Right, hi, do you remember this? I did this on my blog a while ago now, I can't even remember when. Um, but if you're a regular here, you'll remember it. It's a little sheet that I was doodling on, and I think I started it to accompany this when I was making this. This is a pouch that I made for myself. So like, I know that I did use it to inform this at some point, because if you see these French knots down here, that's what they are. So I just wanted to continue it a little bit because it won't take much to finish that actually. So what I was thinking, I've been looking at this and these little tiny like um, raindrop things. I'm wondering if they could mimic these bullion loops which have got French knots at the bottom. So I could put some French knots there, some little circles there. And then these could be these these little pliques with little stems like flowers so that's what i'm going to do today i just want to uh do a little bit of doodling because it's good to doodle and that groove that i set up on Flickr, um it's amazing if you go there and have a look so if i do some circles here like french knots if you go to Flickr and have a look at that group i think there's over 100 pictures in it now so it was obviously a worthwhile exercise. So these are to mimic the French knots at the bottom of the loops on the stitching. And even just three little marks like this. 10 minutes a day on something like this and it doesn't take you long to get a big sheet together. Um, do some up here now. I mean, already that's made a difference. You might not think so, but I can see a difference, a positive difference. Um, there. So if I do another three here, on there. And these colours will be the colours that I used initially. So it'll all live wonderfully together in theory um, I mean what could be better than just holding a handful of pens like this and just doodling three little circles so that's those three done can you see them one I have to do this so two three yeah so now I might put little stalks on these because I think that would uh, oh, enhance, like I say, to mimic these things that are going on here. Okay. I haven't got anything in that pouch yet. Do the first one there. And then add a little leaf, maybe. So very simple, solid leaf there, and another one there, already progress, progress, do one on this one, I have to put my finger on so then I'll look at the camera to see if you can see it, because trust me there's plenty of times when I can't find the camera, I'll really like that, I think that's really added something to this, I like it a lot. So thank you for making me do this. For being the prompt that made me come back to this. And then we've got another one of these. And what it's also telling you is especially that one, and might be the way that that's side on. I could do something with that maybe somewhere else on the sheet because there's still quite a few blank spaces on here. So and I've got another one here, can you see that one, yeah, so in relation to the other two, that's that one and that's that one, so this one, so we'll have a, what colour stalk should we have on that one, have a red one, and I'll do that one, can you see, yeah, can you, no, I'll do that one going that way, and two petals on there. So I mean, how quick was that? 
Well, that to me, you might, you might not notice. You might be thinking, I don't know what you're talking about. But I can see a massive difference in that. Just we've got three, six, nine, nine little circles, three stalks, and six little petals. And it, it really has enhanced that and it's moved it on. And it's also given me another idea for another area. So, you know, you can't go wrong, can you? So, please have a look at the Doodle group. Um, if I remember, I'll put a link in this post. If I don't remember, then I was going to say drop me an email, but I might not be here. Um, but if I don't remember, say in the comments, and I can do it in another post when I come back. But I'll try to remember to put a link into that group. And you can join it. Anybody can join it. You don't need permission. I've got nothing to do with it now. I just set it up, made it available for anyone to join. Um, and I just look at it every day and just gasp and stand back in amazement at all the amazing doodles that are going in there so please take a look even if you don't want to join because I'm sure you'll be amazed at how many pictures are in there and the quality of them okay